Hello, it's Ruby here, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. Now, today it's gonna be a completely different video. Usually, this is going to be my modded survival uh, adventure, uh, but I decided that for builds, I'll do a separate playlist. That way, the series, the modded Minecraft survival adventure, is just focused on the adventure while the buildings is focused on just buildings that way I won't have to worry about uh, what I'm gonna be doing on the next episode and stuff like that now for today's video I'm just gonna be doing something simple which is gonna be the bridge to the library which I did do last episode of my modded minecraft survival adventure and i placed the bushes bushes there and some bushes there to give it a nice decor feeling i also decorated inside and i changed a few things such as this right here and some of that now like i said we're going to focus on the build for the bridge so first let's i've already aligned these together so what i'm going to want to do now is i want to connect these right now so i'm going to use half size for the side right here and we're just gonna keep going until we actually, until we hit the other piece of wood. Okay, so by the looks of it right here, it can end right here. So, instead of ending right here, okay, sorry about that, I could not hear my voice at all. So, right here, I'm just gonna place some of these down to fix that. Uh, right here is actually where the bridge will be, which is alright, which is good. This is good actually. It means it's going to be a shorter bridge than I thought. Okay, it is still roughly a really long bridge, but I'll make it work. So I'm going to finish connecting these right here. And let's see what we're going to do. So I think I might want to do like some, some mid pillars. So let's try to do pillars from five so let's see three four five so let's do some right here there we go that's one pillar so let's go with another one right here it's gonna be th three wide so the other one's gonna be right here it's lagging I don't want to I don't want it to lag and it's gonna be bad and there we go okay so yeah okay so let's do the same thing for the other side Let's continue to do, okay, so let's continue to do the same for the rest of the bridge. Okay, so I finished doing 5-5 five, five for each, and in the middle it looks like it's longer, but I actually don't mind. I could, of course, put a middle pillar, but I think this might just work out in a very good way. So now let's just fill in this middle part right here with wooden half slabs. Now if you're wondering why I'm using half slabs, it's because mobs cannot spawn on top of them. Now I am going to light my bridge up with uh, torches. But I still want to make sure that no mobs can spawn on top of this as well as, you know, anything else. So that's why the roofs are made out of stairs and stuff as well, and planks. Alright, so we have now filled the bridge with the wooden half slabs right here, the slabs. And it's uh, looking plain, of course, because I haven't done anything to customize it. So, now it's the customizing part. So, let's see what I want to do. So, I'm, I'm thinking arches in the bottom here, and then a nice fencing decorated in the sides right here. Alright, so, I was thinking I can use some of this polished andesite to put some of these down. So, I want to make it feel like it's Dirty. And then I'm also gonna put some fence on. Oh god. I'm also gonna put some fence on top of the polish and the site to make it look more like it's also sturdy. So I'm gonna put these right here. 
and I'll be right back with you guys once I have filled all of these out. Alright, so by doing that alone, it looks like it's these little stone pillars right here are holding these pillars up, also holding the bridge up, making it even nicer. Now, it does not look 100% yet, but it is getting there, and one of the things I wanted to do was actually add, add some fencing here to add more of a feeling that it's being supported by the stone pillars right here around the corners. Now, for the arches, I'm thinking under the bridge of course um but we'll see how it turns out first all right so i placed the fencing down and let me show you some things i did so for the sides outside of the from the bridge i put in these fences by two and right here i exchanged the slabs for these planks full planks so i can give it that extra support look now i didn't put anything here on the sides because i figured that since i'm going to do arches here that I might not need the fences here because it'll add more supporting. Now for the slabs, uh, continuing the actual stone, polished stone, I thought that for the arches, we could do something similar with the actual um, bridge right here. So let's do like this. Alright, that, that looks okay. That that looks nice. So, I'm going to repeat this in all of the corners and see how it looks and see if I can work with it. Alright, so it's looking a lot better now, and I really like how it's turning out. Now, let's see. I'm actually liking it a lot. It looks really nice, and so let's see how it looks with torches on at night. It looks really nice. It's very simple, and it really gives off that really sturdy bridge feel. Now, I feel like I can do more with it, but I'm trying to figure out what I can do with it. Now, it doesn't look like much, but at the end of the day, I was going for a regular, simple bridge that can get me from here to here without having to go around the river. Now, I do want to complete the build by creating and finalizing the path here with... With some of the half slabs as well as and making a nice path for it as well as it's been walked on i'm also going to put coarse dirt down to make it give it to give it that extra oomph it needs that way it can give it a better feel to it so i want to add another one there and i really like how it turns out it has a nice path from here to the bridge and I really like it. It's, it's doing its purpose and I, I'm actually impressed that I built this and if you guys like it, make sure to leave a like. Thank you guys for watching today's video about me building a bridge. Now it's a very simple and easy bridge. The materials are simple except for the polished um, andersite. I mean I'm, most of the ingredients are easy to come by so if you guys want to try it out. 
give it a shot. It's not that complicated and it's pretty much the same section after section and you just basically copy it. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. This saves a lot of time on my uh, Modded Survival series. If you guys want to check it out, make sure to check it out as well. And thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode of this uh, series that I want to do of building stuff. So make sure to check out my Modded Survival series. Bye!